Okay, you guys. Look what I just received today. I got my Sola bread. Oh my god, you guys. I am like so excited. They do look kind of a little bit smaller than what I thought, but um, I was too excited because I've been wanting to do some French toast. I know I do my egg loaf, but I wanted to do some French toast. So when I miss, when I start craving stuff like that, I'm like, oh boy, I'm not gonna have a cheat day. So finally, I got my Sola bread order. And I have, I ordered, um, they have different kinds. They have like wheat and um, honey oat. So I got the sweet and buttery. So these are two net carbs. Um, five grams of proteins, four grams of fiber per slice. So one slice is um, two grams, you guys, for that. And then I have um, hamburger buns. I've been wanting to eat a hamburger. Um, well, I've been eating hamburgers on lettuce wrap or like on a low carb tortilla wrap, but. Uh, I haven't had buns for a while so this is nice so the buns are 14 grams of protein 11 grams of fiber and there are six six net carbs each so just be careful when you do eat them because remember you are on keto so um you know these are keto friendly so what i do is that i just load it up with like you know some extra fat in it you know but if you are Counting your macros, do not go, um, you know, make sure there's six net carbs each. And then, you guys, it's been like forever since I've had a hot duck bun because remember, bread is not keto friendly. And the hot duck buns are also six net carbs, 14 grams of protein, 11 grams of fiber each. And they look pretty thick, so, um, that's not bad. So, it looks like, um, you know, you guys, these are kind of filling, especially if you didn't load it up with meat and stuff. So, yes, you guys, this is my Sola bread. Um, I had to order them online because I can never find them in any of the stores, including Walmart. I've been having finding stuff in Walmart, but these are, uh, I cannot find them anywhere. So, I ordered them online, and on top of that, I got them on sale. So, I got the slices of bread, I got the hamburger buns, and the hamburger hot dog. So, I'm going to give them a taste test, and you guys are going to try it with me. Well, you guys are going to enjoy it and watch me enjoy this yummy, yummy, low-carb bread. And hopefully, if it get 10 stars... And you guys are on low carb or on keto, you guys can um, give them a try. All right, you guys, let's eat. Okay, you guys, so um, I'm gonna try this solo bread for um, breakfast and um, this is how they look like they look they don't look too big but they're like kind of like thick so it feels thick and you can tell that they're like made fresh to order so um, I've been wanting a grilled cheese but I've also been wanting like a big salami sandwich so I'm adding my fats on here so I'm gonna put some full fat mayo if you guys try this this is so so good like everybody loves it when I make these at home okay so now okay you guys so like I said I added the full fat but this is only if you're on keto you guys so now I am going to grab oh you know what you guys I grabbed brown cheese This is the cheese that I use because it has less than one card. And remember, each slice of bread has two net cards. And if you guys are not on keto, then you can skip the mayo. I'm just adding the extra fat on there. 
everybody at home loves when I make these sandwiches because I make them really, 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 really good. And then I like to use koto salami. I've been wanting to eat a koto salami sandwich. And as you can see, it has less than one carbs. So I'm going to add a slice there. Then I'm going to add the other half of my deli deluxe. Please. I'm telling you guys, you have to try it because it's so, so, so good. And then I add another piece of ham. And then I take the solar bread and I put it right on top. And then I'm going to show you how I'm going to um, do. I'm doing kind of like a grilled cheese, but I'm just adding the cotta salami. Hold on, you guys. Let me wash my hands. Okay, you guys, so I'm still adding more extra fat on my sandwich. So I got the original country crock. This is where my grilled cheese with butter kicks in. And then I just post it. I put it in the top. Only in the top slice. And you can put it in the, uh, you can toast it in the pan. But today I'm going to slow toast it in my toaster oven. Look at that, you guys. Now tell me you cannot eat good on keto. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, so I take my solar bread grilled cheese style. So I set it up on 375 or 350. It's good. I put it on bake to slow cook it. And then I kind of like put it on 30 minutes. But it's not really like 30 minutes. I don't know how to explain it, but... Like I said, I slow cook it, and then I take my solar bread, and then I put it in the oven, and then I'm going to show you guys later how it's going to look like. Mm -hmm. Yum, 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 yum. Delish. Okay, guys. So, this is how it came out, you guys. Does it look good? This is my grilled cheese with cotta salami and sola bread. Okay, so I'm gonna show with you guys in a minute. And um, with this, I am going to enjoy my rapid fire. If you guys haven't tried this, you guys gotta try it. It is so good, and these have it does have um three net carbs on it you guys because um it does has bread fed butter it has mct oil on it and it has like a burning And it also has like a creamer on it. I actually add another creamer. I added my sugar-free French vanilla on there. But I love, love, love the extra French vanilla. But you don't need it. I just put it extra. So here it comes. To say you guys this creamer it's really really I mean creamer this coffee the keto coffee it's really good it's made from rapid fire and it's so creamy and I actually wanted to show you guys again in case you missed you didn't see on my other video um, keto coffee has three net carbs because it has the MCT oil the bread fat butter and Himalayan salt all right So now my keto coffee is ready. This is so much easier than making your own bulletproof coffee. So you guys gotta try it. I really enjoy this keto coffee from Rapid Fire. It's very, very um, creamy. Then I add my two tablespoons of stevia. I 
Um, as you know, sometimes when you're keto, your hair thins. So I use these for hair skin and just pour. I use the Ar Orgain Collagen Peptides. And this is founded by a cancer survivor. So, so usually it's like two scoops. I use um, two scoops of collagen. That's great for your hair, skin, and muscles. So your sometimes the hair thins a little bit because you're in keto. So this is perfect. Um, it's usually two scoops on any drink. You can um, you can also play with it. So you can put in smoothies, coffee, um, water. Um, you can also bake with it. Um, it's good for strong hair and nails. Um, I use it on my coffee. I do. Um, you can do half a scoop every day or you can do a scoop every day, but the dose is um, two scoops But I'm gonna be honest with you. Sometimes I get a little uh, Hard for me to uh, use the bathroom. So I just do the two scoops every two or three days on my coffee you guys and look how yummy that looks It's like nice and creamy I gave it 10 stars for the solar bread slices of bread. So now, we just gotta try the hot thick buns and the hamburger buns, and I hope they're just as good as their slices of bread. that again. Alright, stay tuned guys. Next is going to be for dinner. We're going to have some hamburger and hot dogs on our soda buns and hamburger buns. 
Time for taste test. Would it get 10 stars like the size of red? I guess we'll find out. Okay, guys. So this is the um, Sola hot dog bread. This is how it looks like. It looks like it's kind of thick. For, neck, for six neck carbs. So remember, if you're going to eat these, make sure that you remember that they contain six net carbs, so you, so you stay within your macros. And now I am getting the hamburger bun. So this is how the solo hamburger bun is. Like I said, for breakfast, I had the sweet and buttery. And as you can see, there's just as soft as the, as the slice of bread from this morning. So kind of sort of like a bagel but I'm gonna warm these up a little bit in the toaster and then I'm gonna set it up and with some meat some healthy fats and then we'll give it a taste test hopefully it gets 10 stars like the solar slices of bread okay you guys so I baked my hamburgers now I'm just gonna put a little bit of mustard ah, if I have any left I guess I gotta put that on my grocery list and now I am going to pour my okay so now I'm gonna put some of my sugar free ketchup I'm gonna blow my hot dog with ketchup. Don't worry, you guys, and it is no sugar added. Okay, so now I have my hamburger for extra fats. I have avocado, mustard, and ketchup. And for extra um, fat, I got my full fat mayo. I'm gonna put my soda bread on there, and then for my hot dog. A lot of people think it's weird, but for me it's not. I like my hot dogs fried, you guys. So for the extra fat there, I fried it in um, avocado oil. I added some guacamole too. And sugar-free ketchup and mustard, you guys. So uh, these on my new Sola bread. Remember, um, each bun is 6 net carbs. So I have a total of 12, 13, 14 net carbs, you guys. And with my breakfast that I ate earlier, that's the total over there of, um, that was, four, five, six, it was seven net carbs. So total I have 19 carbs, guys, for all these food. Plus I fasted today. So if I get hungry throughout the night, I'll just have myself like a jello snack. No carbs. Alright you guys, so here is the Sola Hot Dog, can't wait to try it, let's give it a try. Just like the size of the bread, the solar bread is just as good, airy, fresh, soft. Mm. Mm. Buttery. I'm ready, guys. If you haven't tried the guacamole with hot dog. Get it, you guys, it's so good. I 
I keep the hot dog buns, 10 stars. I will definitely buy again. Getting a sip of my Diet Pepsi. I'm giving it a change of the my cold icy bubbly salsa water. Now for the hamburger. As you can see, my son already took a bite. He just likes when I get my keto food ready. He's like, it tastes just like regular food. So I'll tell you guys, it's pretty good. All right, big bite on the hamburger bun. Wow. Thank you, Sola. coming out This dinner was awesome. For the hamburger buns, I give it 10 stars, you guys. 10 stars. Woo! 10 stars, 10 stars, 10 stars out of 10. Cause so oh, 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 you did it again. Ouch! <laughs> okay, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed my day today. I'm happy you, tr you guys came and tried the Sola bread with me. Like I said, the slices of bread, their hamburger buns, and their heart buns are so good. Um, keto friendly. Um, if you're low carb, it's just as fine. Um, for keto, just remember um, to add some good fats in there when you make the sandwiches and make sure you are um, adding it into your macros if you are counting um, your macros on keto. And I have to say, Sola, it's really, really good. I will be buying it again. Um, I wish it would have you know, we can get some more in the bag, you know, um, but um, it's fine, it's just as good. They're very tasty, very airy, very fluffy. Um, you could tell they're just so freshly made to order. I order mine online. This is just so good. Um, you can warm it up, you can toast it. Um, I, I always like my bread warm, but um, if you don't want it warm, it's just as good. But it's so delicious, you guys. And I'm so glad that you guys spent another keto day with Johnny. If you are new to my channel, do not forget to subscribe. Give me a like. Give me two big thumbs up. Don't forget to share. Comment down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.